to the church in North America and all the saints and sinners therein. My plea to the North American church is simple. November 2008, church. Dear sisters and brothers in North America, I beg you, get serious about following Jesus. Vast segments of the self-professed Christians in North America are lukewarm, culturally conformed persons whose actual lives contradict their Christian confession. They are almost as promiscuous, almost as materialistic as their unbelieving neighbors. We're the richest uh, you know, continent probably in human history. Uh, incredible wealth. Uh, verbally, uh, many of us still say we're uh, Christians. Uh, but uh, somehow I think we've been enticed uh, by the surrounding culture. That's always been the uh, temptation of the church, you know, to slowly conform to the culture rather than to follow Jesus' radical kingdom norms. The temptation to water down Jesus' radical teaching, to slowly conform to surrounding culture, has always been powerful in Christian history. And Christians have regularly manufactured rationalizations for their failure to follow Jesus, whether the issue was sharing with the poor, loving their enemies, or keeping their marriage vows. But repeated failure is no excuse for disobedience. Whatever. It's about deciding that Jesus Christ is the center of my life, that he's true God and true man, that he rose from the dead, uh, that his messianic kingdom is broken into history, and now in the power of the Spirit, we can begin to live out his kingdom values 